So, I have mentioned this in, uh, I have mentioned this while I've been streaming, but I was like, one of the things I mentioned, I think a while ago, on one of the reviews, which was like, oh, there's no more reviews left, because I thought this was going to be 12 episodes. And then I watched uh, Straw Hat Goofy, which is, who is absolutely awesome. It's like, oh, this is the final episode. So I'm like, oh. <laughs> well, why, why I look like an why I, no, no, I thought, why I look like a <laughs> I was like, there must be way more episodes. It's like, there's probably two more episodes. And then I was like, huh. Because I saw the thing that they left, which, is, which I now realize was a cliffhanger. I was like, oh, that's what we're going to do for the final two episodes. No, that's a cliffhanger. I just realized that's a cliffhanger. Uh, but yeah, the series is really good. And I think I mentioned this when I was reviewing the original, because this is based off the X-Men from 1997. Hence why it's called X-Men 97. But the one thing that I find absolutely interesting, rightfully or wrongfully, this feels, unlike other superhero films, this feels like no one is safe. Now you have a couple characters come back, but some of the characters are like, oh, and then it's like, uh, 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 am I, is that just me? It's so good by that idea. And they're not, they are willing to be like, and now die. I don't know, because Straw Hat Goofy, and I do actually agree with this, but Straw Hat Goofy's mentioned something, I'm like, they might do it, where it's like superhero films, it would, that wouldn't be a surprise, where it's like, and then... It's just an alternate timeline of every dread con. Uh, because one of the characters who died, I'm like, I, I don't want this character to die. I'm trying to not say because I want, because there's a big moment when it happens and I want to leave it like that. It was awesome. But yeah, X-Men 97 was why I watched the series because I heard about it before. The only thing that I heard about it was like, it was really deep and I saw a bit about one of the episodes where, like, Logan goes with his team and there's, like, really effed up, like, mind things. It's like, Jesus. What the fuck? Uh, but yeah, besides that, uh, yeah, this is awesome. Go and watch it.